Ladies and gentlemen, what it do? It's your boy K Styles here. And yes, I have a question from a Mr. Ghost Peppers. Shouts out to this brother for this question. But to sum it all up, he's just basically saying if they don't fix their defense, will Matt Ryan get blamed again for another season? This is a very good question to ask here because we have a contingent of the Falcon fan base that wants him gone by any means necessary. And it's also not being helped that not only the national wide media, but the local media is what's feeding this narrative. Now, if you're looking at it from a standpoint of him being kind of the face of the franchise, um, yes, the quarterback is usually the face of the franchise. So they're gonna get a lot of the praise and a lot of the blame when they're losing. Now, I did my research, and no, Arthur, he's not part of the Arthur Blaine family. He is not married into it, so we can kill that rumor now. Now, if you talking about his arm is dead, I don't see a dead arm at all. Um, is it the strongest? It never was, but it wasn't, it wasn't dead. I think what the main problem is, with the Falcon fan base is more so is they want the flash. He doesn't stand out. Um, he's kind of like a lunch pail guy. You know, nowadays the lunch pail guys are usually the ones that get sh talked about the most, shit talked on. Um, but my main thing is I say with a problem that I have with Matt Ryan as far as his game is not his skill set, but it's more so of his um yes man mentality that he has he doesn't um yeah like I said, he's just basically a yes man um do i feel like do he need to be more assertive to get better definitely and i feel like with arthur smith and dave ragone putting them back in the system he's familiar with would definitely help a lot all right people deuces